Welcome back, everyone, to episode 307 of our Let's Play to reform the Taiyi sect. Let's get started with this game and see where we're at. Uh, I know our frog is getting there. Looks like he's still got more thinking to do. Um, he's actually ready to lock in this intelligence. We'll do that. Definitely getting gems uh, and watching boulders, of course. Synthesize that. Um, yeah, he does have uh, sculptures as well, but uh, I guess we'll see if he gets uh, the blue stuff that we're looking for. So far, not looking very good. But uh, who knows? Still early on in the thought process there. What else we got going on here? I don't think we have anything coming up until... Yeah, the 7th. Any events going on or anything? Let's see. I think we dealt with this last time. Yeah, a bunch of people were asking for stuff. We accidentally gave, I think, Mount Lucian a second uh, spirit route for free. That's the uh, that's the kind of hospitality you get when you deal with the Taiyi sect. Sometimes we give you more than you ask for. Uh, at no cost to you. <laughs> Eventually we just make a mistake, really. Um, t -t -t -t. let's check our, um, Chen Dao. Yeah, okay, right. We still need one on him. And we can start getting Izanami sympathetic. She's up to 28 of 36 on Greedy. Maybe we could eat... Maybe we could eat, um... Eat a couple sun pills up here on uh, Izanami. It's not like they need more max chi, but sun pills are pretty easy to make, I think, too. And it would make sense to use. Oh, okay, actually, she's already eaten sun pills. Um, hmm. What about, yeah, the Phoenix and. She's already eaten a little bit of that, too. She could eat more, though. Let's do that. I think Jing is also eating this stuff, right? Uh, I think she's done right there. Let's see. She's got 38.96. Let's do one more round of this. 38.96. So that was worth 29 for two of them. Yeah, I think she's done. So she's at 83.32, and she went up to yeah, 84.99. Yeah, so she's not really... She's basically done with that stuff. So she's set. Uh, anything else we need to eat, we should take care of that now. Uh, no. Uh, except for Wicked Flux. Do we have a lot of Wicked Flux? I think we were running out of that. Um, we've got some now. I think that's an okay amount. We'll have to add more when we consume more, but... Frankly, we need to keep the number of Tier 12 items we have uh, low. We have all these nice uh, attainment reducers, but we don't want to use any of them. We want our attainment to be high. It's a very weird conundrum. I feel like... I feel like the 10th attainment tribulation is probably going to be really challenging. Although, if anyone can do it, it's going to be a, a wood cultivator. For sure. Uh, and sh Man, she has 2.8 million G. Kinda nuts. Alright. Let's grow our trees. Whilst I think about what else we were doing. I think uh, we're going to learn on Ent Ross. Ent Ross has been stacking XP. Uh, not some guy right now, for sure. He's uh, immortal right now. Working on his training. We're not even going to feed him stuff. We're just going to have him go on natural, as they say. Uh, at some point, we will have to work on Yato as well, for sure. He's missing a lot of stuff. A lot. We've hardly touched Yato. Uh, for now, I think Entross has all of the gear on him already. 
Yeah, he's got, he's got zero sub spirits. He's pretty new. Um, yeah, and he's got 181 million. Does he have any spells already? He has a Nate Chi. Um, you could probably give him a uh, Firestorm and Chaos Void. Can we do that? Oh, hold on. Let's make sure he's got everything equipped. Yes. Attainment, attainment. And attainment. Perfect. So he's actually ready to go. All right. So can we get Firestorm? I don't think we can get Astro Flare. I'm pretty sure that's a... Uh, oh, yeah, it's cheap, too. Nice. Astro Flare is a True Sun ability only. So we can get Chaos Void. That's a pretty good one to have. And it's Orthodox, too. This one should probably be on basically everyone, honestly. Do Vitality Chant. Reverse a cycle. Let's do that. And then we'll learn uh, Reverse a Cycle Secret after that. That'll give him two rows of spells, and they'll be very well organized. I really wish you could reorganize those afterwards. <laughs> That's kind of a pain. Um, he has Spiritual Breath Chant already, which is nice. Metal Spirit Root. It's hard to click these trees when we uh, put all the uh, fancy stuff in there. I mean, this tree is definitely loving life right now, but we're not. How do we even mouse over the tree, you know? There we go. It grows at 400% now. Quite nice. This one grows at only 108. This one's almost done. This is the main thing we've been looking at, but... It's like, every time we check, it's like, yeah, I've gone up another 0.3%. Should be very soon, though. Very soon. I have uh, Jing switch over here in, like, 0.3% uh, or so. Okay. Cool. Now, I think this tree is blessed this time. No, it's actually slightly cursed. It is tending toward or trending towards bless. Kind of weird. I guess the fire tree does get uh, cursed pretty easily. Hmm. Bit strange. Uh, we could probably add more gnarled vines in here too if we get lucky. Um, I think we have plenty of gnarled vines too, right? I think we got five. Let's give it a shot. Nice. Man. Yes, that's the other big one we were looking for. Nice. We'll take it. Alright, so we need three more gnarled vines. That should add quite a lot of chi. I'm not sure if I want to keep the one on the root, though. Yeah, it's kind of obnoxious. Let's just remove that. So we got two more. Could probably remove this phoenix wood and try to get uh, a gnarled vine in there, too, though. Let's give it a shot. Let's pull this out. There we go. I guess it's more deterministic than I thought. I used to think it was, like, kind of random, but it... It does seem to always go into the next lowest spot in the vicinity. Seems like it. Um, yeah, normal vine. There we go. Uh, we actually do, or we could use quite a few more gnarled vines around here too. And actually Phoenix would as well. Probably use some more of that too. Like all of these could probably be Fe or like like yeah, these three should be Phoenix wood for sure. I think. Let's add some of that in. Okay. 
This should be slightly better. And actually maybe just a bit of Phoenix wood right up here. Should like this a little bit better, I would imagine. Seems like it. 214%. Definitely seems to be doing good. Oh, wow, we do have Devil Claws here. Hmm. We really don't need those anymore? What? Yeah, we do need them. Why am I still using Soul Pearls right here? Did we, we prioritize the tree over, uh, it's got a flood dragon horn now. <laughs> what are we doing with that over here? I guess we were trying to just ramp this up as quickly as we can. Well, if we fight the flood dragon again, uh, we'll get enough, um, claws to finish, um, finish this array. So I don't think it's a big deal, but. Hmm. Yeah, odd. Very odd indeed. Morality seal. It's good stuff. Yeah, this fire array is pretty rad. It's about as good as it gets. Obviously, uh, we need a bunch of tier 5 stuff, but... It's pretty good. Pretty good. Okay, Entross has got the worst uh, affliction in the game. That's not going to stop him from learning. Uh, oh, yeah. We need to make sure he learns... Uh, actually, come over here first. Although the better spot is over here, but whatever. I'm about to have him learn on this manual, so it's okay. Um, reverse a cycle secret. Uh, of course, he's going to get that as well. Uh, no brainer. Eventually, he'll probably learn Botanic Revitalization, too, just to get his Orthodox attainment up, honestly. Um, in fact, he might even learn this, too, even though he doesn't need it. No. All of his skills are good, so I think we can go to town. Ent Ross. There you are. Uh, let's do sub stuff first. Because I know that these usually are... Oh yeah, that's right. The wood cultivators have this problem, don't they? Because we, we would like Terra Force or Void Worship for sure. These are costly. Let's do Void Worship first. Wise Detachment and then... I like that we have two spirits, but I th I, we've found this before, but it's like, how did we get a second one? <laughs> one of them has additional text on it, too, but it's the same thing. Uh, allows you to obtain a subspirit, and then this one's like, manipulate your opponent. <laughs> it's, like, <laughs> it's like this one came uh, from some other manual or from some other law or something. It's like, you already know what this is. It's just one attainment less. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Uh, we'll look at some spirit after this round. Um, let's do power stuff. Yeah. Yeah, all of this uh, hurts. Maybe we won't do some of these yet, but... <laughs> Yeah, all the metal stuff really hurts. It's really counteractive, but we really don't care either. I mean, we 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 do kind of care. That's that's gonna be uh, that's gonna be a lot of damage right there to our uh, stockpile of uh, attainment for sure. Okay, yeah, there, there we go. Here's, here's the massive stuff that we want. Okay. 
That should drain a good 30, 40 million off, no problem. No problem at all. How's Jing coming along on her, uh, oh, she's still medium. Yeah, still a ways to go. What's her cultivation bonus? Are you serious? More angry Yao guy. Did we do something to upset these guys? I don't get it. Uh, none of them are... Well, I guess that guy's okay. He's a killer. Cruel and calm. Let's get these guys... Should be good enough. They're probably all gonna fall over, to be honest. Uh, I was gonna say, you don't need to spear or fly. Your fight speed is probably better than that thing. Looks like most were ki well, yeah, four of seven were killed. Anyone else want to get back up? That's all of them. Yeah. Good. Attack solved. Yeah, we've had a lot of attacks lately. It's kind of weird. Definitely a little bit strange. Uh, Wood Shang, uh, now I think it is finally your time, sir. I think we meant to do this in the last episode, but we got kind of sidetracked. Um, just like now. Uh, actually, yeah, we'll have, we'll feed, feed the wood tree, uh, one of these corpses. It's a better idea. So, and, or, uh, wood shang, you're a demigod now. Uh, that's right, we were doing ascension tribulations. That's right, you know what, we were doing these. We got three done. I remember now. Three or four. Uh, and I think he did it without a problem. I think that's why I ended the last episode, is because I knew I wouldn't have to worry about this next one. So I'm going to assume that I was wise in that regard. Earth destroys water. And uh, we'll see if we make a mistake. Then again, I don't have any buffs on right now. <laughs> so maybe he will die. Uh, he's got an OP needle. It's already been reforged four times. It gained, uh, what, about eight eight artifact power uh, through those reforgings. Yeah, uh, this is going to be so easy for him because they just don't lose chi, you know? Like, you just don't lose chi. And you're smacking this thing for decent damage. I bet you if we got more turn speed too, it'd be even better. Like, look at how fast, look at how fast this thing's flying up there. Bam! Bam. <laughs> when it's circling around here, it's actually absorbing chi. You'll notice, and then it just immediately just gets flung into the cloud. We don't even need a. <laughs> we don't even need chi regeneration stuff. This is kind of absurd. This is only rank 4, but the fact that it's this easy, kind of crazy. Uh, I suppose we'll put the bull up here. Uh, 
Uh, we can do more enlightened now that I, I, I guess. I mean, uh, we had to eat a uh, life spring, I'm pretty sure it was, in order to do the last uh, breakthrough sinking. And he doesn't need anything to ascend, so... Uh, sure. I think we were going to do Nigh Die originally. Come over here first. It's going to be a long night for you, but you'll be a lot brighter afterwards. So it'll be worth it. Uh, no. No. No sleep. Yeah, for some reason, last time we had a problem using this on her for some reason. It was kind of strange, right? It was a weird issue. Apparently we have three desire stacks, so that's not looking good for us. Obviously we didn't get furious. Um, sculptures we already had. Did we get another sculptures? No. So, uh, yeah, that's... It's not looking very good for us. Smelling or medic or sweet? Smelling incense is 200 chi, but that's not anything to uh, be happy about, I don't think. There's watching boulders. Yeah, we got nothing here. Secret body defense rate's okay. But we already have sculptures, so we're already good. Um, well, if Furious comes up next, we're going to have to think on it then. So I'm going to lock in sculptures, I think. And we're just going to pray that we get Furious. That's basically how this is going to work. Uh, and Smelling Medic or Smelling Sweet. One of those two. Okay. I wonder if we could uh, sniff or observe a, uh, a needle. An acupuncture needle to get Smelling Medic. I don't know. Last time we tried playing around with that, it wasn't very deterministic from what I could tell, but but you'd think it would be, right? Smelling medic. Like maybe a, a healing herb would do it, but you never know. Yeah, I don't know. You could try to observe like a uh, uh, an iron medicine table. Could be worth a shot. I mean, what else would it give us, right? <laughs> the iron medicine table, like... It's got to give us smelling medic, right? I'm starting to wonder if this bird is trapped. I think he's trapped, actually. Okay. I don't know if he was or not, but... Uh, I, I believe he was. Hopefully we can build that, yeah, without this problem happening. Let's just move this out of the way temporarily. Uh-huh. So, the bull that just decided to come on in became Mad December. What a jerk. This is what we call the Trojan Bull, guys. Um... And immediately he goes around wrecking stuff. Yeah, this is definitely a Trojan. You know, you know what the, the uh, Yao guy attackers, they were like, hey, if we can't kill him, let's just send in this bull. <laughs> let's just send in Mad December to take him out. <laughs> the guy was here for like, what, a half a day? <laughs> Trojan bull. That's what we call that tactic. That was a good one, but we've seen it before. It's not going to catch us off guard now. Uh, we have a wood timber axe. I think we meant to make this out of dark steel. I'm going to smelt that thing. Oh no, that's right. That was the replacement gear that we uh, took off of uh, one of these people. To you on or you shall one of them? Probably to you on, yeah. She doesn't have a weapon. She can have a, a gray stone sword. Or better yet, just give her a bow.
Nidai is going to sleep all day because she was enlightened. Who else could we give this to? To Yuan, perhaps? Mm hmm. They always try to leave. Whoa! Okay, hold on, hold on. Stop. Man. She flew out of here. Okay, try this again. <laughs> Let's uh, go down to 1x speed. Yeah, look how fast she is. Why is she so fast? Oh, okay. Let's disable that temporarily. My gosh. Uh, yeah, it's a little bit easier to deal with. There we go. <laughs> yeah, that's. it's a nice talisman for a reason. We'll probably have uh, one more enlightened in him before he's done. Uh, Ent Ross, though, needs to continue learning stuff. You've got uh, quite a lot to learn still. Actually, let's just go through the regular. Oh, right, yeah, let's do our sub spirit stuff first. So we can still. Oh, man. I think you're supposed to take Fervent Spirit, obviously, but... Bonus Chi Bear. I mean, I suppose... Uh, extra Spell Power. We kind of do want more Attainment, as weird as that sounds. I'm pretty sure all five of these are, are um, mutually exclusive. Cannot coexist. That's what they call it in the game. I mean, the stats are irrelevant because Ent Ross is a max character, I'm pretty sure. If he's not, he will be with all of the uh, extra stat manuals we'll give him. Just to boost, boost his attainment again. So it's really just Chi Barrier or Spell Power. Well, Spell Power and 7 attainment or Chi Barrier and 27. Terra Force just sounds better, honestly. Feels wrong. But also, it doesn't. I kind of feel like we should take Terra Force, so we're gonna. And honestly, we should probably do this, too. <laughs> we didn't do it for the whole game. And it's like, now we know we need attainment, so... And extra stamina is not bad. So I suppose we should always take that regardless. Uh, yeah, more spell power is always good. Yep. Uh, we will take spell damage on him too. Is this uh, visible? Oh, uh, protect. Eh. Effect is okay. I don't, in practice, it doesn't seem to be worth it, though. You know? It doesn't actually seem to be uh, helpful. I guess it is. It is okay, I guess, in the Torch Dragon fight, to be honest. That's about the only time I would ever use it. We know that this is a good spell. Let's pick that up right now. It's unorthodox, but uh, definitely worth it. It's only three, so. It's nice having those shotguns to uh, take out the uh, dragon avatars in the torch dragon fight. I feel like that's basically all we kind of are gearing for now. Like, that's the main thing, is to have an easier time on that fight, because, man, it is still brutal. Still very brutal. What is this? Oh, I think we chose it for the uh, low chi cost and decent damage. But it's counteractive. We're not going to take that. I'm sure there's probably... I'm, I'm betting we might have another spell that's really good now that we just haven't spotted yet. One of these days I'm going to have to go through and look at all of them. 
Because they're all like randomly generated to some extent, I'm pretty sure. The ones that we get from the laws and whatnot. Um, <laughs> it's five attainment. Uh, we don't need the luck at all, but it's five orthodox attainment. Oh, we might do that in the future. We're not really trying to go for attainment yet. We're trying to get powerful first. But I feel like, uh, I feel like we'll be picking that up in, in due time. This is a pretty low chi cost, very fast cooldown, and does pretty decent damage. Don't let the numbers fool you on here. They all get modified a bunch of times by your spell power, so the actual damage and costs are way higher. But that looks like a pretty uh, good spread from what we've seen uh, with other uh, spells and whatnot. Um, Spellcast delay is kind of cool, but those are counteractive and they're unorthodox, so we don't need that right now. Too much, too much. Mm -hmm. Massively increases spell power for nine. It is unorthodox, though. That one's massive increase to spell power for two. I will take that. In fact, I'm going to mark... Um, no, I'm not going to mark them. Not everyone uses spell power. Although I'm starting to think everyone probably should use spell power. Some people obviously be better at it than others, but like... The more spell power you have, the better your restoration stuff is, so the more tribulations you can do, ultimately the greater, you know, strength you can obtain for yourself. Attain. Whatever. So, yeah, I'm starting to think everyone should have a spell. Maybe that's weird. Uh, we'll probably, uh, let's just take both of these right now. Sure. Obviously, we'll catch those when we go back into those uh, sections, but. Yes, please. Spell cast time and spell cooldown for sure. Um, Heavenly Pan Panacea kind of makes sense as well on these characters, too, just because it's so cheap. Let's just take it. Uh, we'll pass on Spear Shield for now, and Divine Bolt. We'll probably end up getting them anyway. Just like Earth Mother, it's like, we didn't really need it, but honestly, like, <laughs> it's like, we're going to take it anyway, I feel like. Uh, this one we have to take as well. Yep. In fact, actually, um, let's just check this as well, because it's orthodox and it's chi. Always going to take that, pretty much. Can't think of any reason why I wouldn't. Miss Mo time. Um, and actually, I don't even think I want this checked anymore. Oh, this is a core shaper ability. Yeah, never mind. We probably will be taking that every time. For anyone that's serious, right? Because then we get, uh, we can probably eat another Wicked Flux because of that, maybe. Uh, oh, yeah. We, uh, yeah, this spell in particular is another shotgun. We want that. Only two as well. Nice. Um, yep. Power Artifact is interesting. I know whenever we pop the North Sword, that's always an, a nice ability, but I don't know how to measure it. Like, is it 59% off of your damage afterwards, or is it, like, 59% of your base before it gets modified? Depending on, like, where that 59% comes into play, it could be very good or very meager, you know? 
There's a kind of a range. These are things that I kind of wish I knew. Just the, the, the funny formulas that the game uses to figure stuff out. Because they don't make it very, like... You can't, like, measure what your damage is, right? You basically just have to test it out. Uh, elixir concoction speed. Uh, we will take that. Uh, Jing, you can use that. It's not good. Heavy snow, sense chi, studies. Alright. Back to Woodshang. Wait, oh! Oh, Kunlun, okay. Spiritual breath. I meant to do that earlier. Now, I know I made a mental note for who I wanted to have go to Kunlun. And of course, mental notes don't stay with me very long. Yeah. I can't remember who I was going to send. I'm trying to think, who would it be? Could be Yato. Yato could do, um... Yato could go fight, I suppose. I feel like there was someone else that we were trying, though. Hmm. Tanetta already did it, yeah. We would just get another booing for Yato Gami. We did that. Which is cool. Definitely not uh, besmirching that by any means. It's nice to have a nice uh, new uh, cloak. And Ross could go as well, too. Maybe participate in spellcasters or something. Let's just send um, Yadogami. We've been, we've been very unkind to Yadogami, and I know someone... <laughs> One of you guys out there, um, I think it was Shade, if I want to say, if I, if I had to say. I can't remember. Uh, one of you guys obviously uh, requested to have Yadogami installed in the game. And uh, we haven't really been uh, treating him that well. So, you know what? He's going to get a fancy cloak. And I'll even give him a bonus of a bunch of Spirit Dew. He should eat it when he comes back, I think. Okay. Uh, Jing also needs a bunch of spirit dew. Um, okay, maybe the eat does get cancelled. Yeah, I think it does get... We'll give him spirit dew when he comes back. We actually have a lot right now. Let's just eat all eight of this. And then after that, then you can eat that and that. Okay. Um, it is now the 8th, so it's the day after Five Dragons Pond. Which is yet another um, Rhythm Lotus. I think we were f finally starting to run low on these things. Uh, Prism Lotus belongs to... This one belongs to Mount Sunshade, so we can send anyone. Okay. Uh, anyone else for... You know what, Yu Xiao, you can get... Chang's uh, final blessing. Oh, he can't be. Oh, okay, so I guess we already did uh, Enlightened with Yu Xiao. Uh, Ganyan?
Hmm. Can't do Ganyan either. It's gonna have to be Ishii. Come on down, Ishii. Do the price is right. It's gonna cost you nothing. And you're suddenly gonna be smarter. Um, as long as you don't run out, right? Oh no, yeah, he's right here. Okay, yeah, he is trying to run out. No. There you go. That should be the last of his uh, lifespan, I, th I think. Yeah. He's got seven years to live. It's okay. He's only got like seven more tribulations, too. Probably less than that, actually. He's already on, um, yeah, number five. Of course, he's going to make this look a lot easier than I than, than some guy, I think. Because obviously he's been around for a lot longer and his max G is higher and, you know, all that stuff. Um, yeah, I'm trying to remember who he wanted to do. Who he wanted to do uh, what with here? I remember. Maybe it was Phoenix, perhaps. We might send Phoenix next year for a magic duel, but I can't I can't remember. I feel like there was someone in particular that I really wanted to have it on. Or I was like leaning towards, but whatever. Anyway, uh Yaragami's gonna cut everyone down. Kunlun swordsman. And he gets a fancy cloak. Mm-hmm. One day, so apparently we did bad math. Yeah, one days or so. Fire Chi. It's actually the one that we don't really want to give away. Um, can I afford it? No, I don't. Are we getting any soon? I think Jade Stone is not it. Alchemist Peak is not it. Uh, Blaze Nest in a month. So that would be, yeah, a Crimson Fruit for sure. Um, Alright, let's give away our last one, I guess. I don't, really, I don't really think this is a good idea, but... Honestly, we get so many from random sources. We'll probably just get another one, right? And one more of those events, and we can get another uh, high-tier item if they happen to stock one. They, they were the ones that recently stocked uh, a spirit seed, I think it was, last episode or something like that. Okay, and Ross, you're doing good. Uh, actually, he has a study task still, so he must be, yeah, out of uh, inspiration already. Man, that was 180 million, I think it was. Just like that, gone. Uh, what's his attainment looking like? Oh, he's got over 800. Nice. Nice. Quite good. Alright. Uh, stop cultivating. Only time... Oh. He actually took it seriously. <laughs> he immediately stopped cultivating. You guys are just whiners. So, um, yet again, I don't think we need to prepare with any special items. Uh, we are getting rank 5 now on this, uh, because, uh... Oh, wait. He's still tired. Okay, none of those matter. It says decreases cultivation stats, mental speed, cultivation speed, inspiration, and breakthrough. None of that actually matters. I was worried that it was actually detracting from our physical prowess. That would have been bad. Luckily, it does not look like that's the case. Uh, so he is getting five stacks. Uh, is that our last vessel? That is our last vessel. 
Let's move this back over here. Oh my gosh. Is a pain. How did we do this again? We did... Move this out of the way and then try to move the other thing. I think we did a, a two two item or something. I can't remember. Ay ay ay. Hopefully someone comes along to move this out of the way for uh poor soul. Or I guess we move that first. Someone Someone. It's obnoxious. Let's just build three. Okay. Let's put this here first. They should do that from over here or here, right? No? Um, it's like a, it's a Chinese puzzle. It's, not, it's like a Chinese, like, finger trap, you know what I mean? Oh, man. This is awful. Okay. So let's try... <laughs> oh, boy. I kind of, um, you know what, let's just stop these for now and then, because I don't know what's going to happen uh, to the um, the jobs if I move it. I don't, I don't think it breaks them, but I don't want to risk it, really. Or not risk it, but like, okay, let's move this first, and then we'll move this down. And then move this in. <laughs> oh, this is a joke. It's a cruel joke. I feel like, um... Gosh, I don't know how to do this. Oh, no, and we missed our event, too. Ah. I was thinking I still had, like, another few days, because it wasn't growing that fast. Hmm. Well, what did you learn? Plus 18% in? Wow, that's kind of crazy. Oh, it's unorthodox, though. Uh, I suppose you can transfer your knowledge. Man, I can't believe I missed another one of these. That's my own negligence, though. I knew that I should have been watching it. I've just been distracted. I blame this. Jade wall and marble wall. Uh, let's harvest this thing as well. And some bandits should be on their way, too. Do we have anything else for spring? Oh, uh, yeah, actually. We've got to go back here again. <laughs> right. They're not going to do anything in because they're sleeping anyway. Jeez, I can't believe I missed that. I should have just set her over here anyway. It doesn't matter if she's there that early. Oh, ooh, nice. More uh, spirit dew. Even though we have quite a lot of that right now. Uh, Sutra dude, you can join in as well. You like to kill stuff. 
Apparently, uh, yeah, some... Some random visitor's corpse. Some of our walls got destroyed. This person's charging Sutra Dude. Probably not gonna work out that well for ya. Yeah. Didn't work out that well for either of you. Oh, only one of them was dead here. You know, we've got a lot more uh, bandits coming too, so try to make a. Uh, try to pack these guys in dense. Uh, speaking of which, packing things in, we need to equip the cloak, the Bu Ying. What's his title, actually? Spiritualist Heaven and Earth. Actually, for a spiritualist one, that sounds pretty cool. Yeah, I like that. Would be nice if we could uh, choose our titles or acquire some other fancy ones. I think, well, obviously you can acquire some additional ones just by traveling enough. Yeah, no. Not allowed to. Actually, yeah, we need to keep an eye on this periodically too because I think he's eating like a, a gnarled vine still or something like that. He's just been snacking on them. Which makes sense, too. I'm pretty sure we had a ton of gnarled vines recently. Now we have a ton of acarescence. We've got even more right there. Yeah, so time to chop this tree down. Unfortunate that we missed that again. Uh, right, the other... <laughs> I'm messing up all over the place today. The other tree that we were supposed to use is gone now as well. Hmm. Yeah. Okay, so, Jade Wall. If we build this, hopefully they come in through here. I hope. Or actually, oh, you know what? Let's do it like this. There's no way it can mess up then. No way, right? Just take out the four. That gives us two different paths out. Okay, good. Jade Wall is in. There's no way they would build the Jade Wall from over here, so I think we're good. Jade Wall. Yes. Now, this should go in without a problem, because we'll stand somewhere around here. Yeah. Man. It's a puzzle every time. You know, I'm going to blame uh, I'm going to blame this this on my uh <laughs> it was clearly my fault. I should have said uh, I should have said uh, We'll know for the future. Just set her up with plenty of stamina. It doesn't matter if she's there like 1 or 2% early. That's just the way to do it. Remove. Actually, this is not one of the bandits, is it? Or maybe it is. They're not attacking right away. Hmm. This might not be one of the bandit groups, which is kind of crazy. It's not. They're just standing there. Okay, we dealt with that very quickly. 
I don't think that was one of the bandit groups. That's kind of crazy. We've been attacked by bandits twice, plus then the tree event. I guess we're just known for having everything now. I mean, our sect, um, yeah, our sect is now 112 million reputation. It's kind of insane. He finally got him. Sutra dude is so bad with an artifact. I think I'm going to cancel this chi tide. I don't really need it here. You know what? Let's give him a nice, uh, nice protection bonus. Oh, actually, we're not cultivated anymore. Interesting. Or, um, blessed anymore. Hmm. Strange. Did we break any other rooms? Um, all other rooms should be good. This room, uh, got renamed again. I don't even know if this is worth, uh, renaming constantly. Feels like they get broken all the time. Maybe we could double wall these. Reduce the, uh, possibility of that happening, perhaps. Someone left their clothes in the water while they're skinny dipping. Yeah, invasion of enemies is the uh yeah. These are the guys looking for the, the fruit. From the tree of power. Uh No, they destroyed my dog. Dang it. Uh, luckily, I think, yeah, it's Lumina Core Bar, because we were kind of fancy with it. That sucks. You jerks. All because I think I clicked attack on this Crane Lantern or something instead. Drat. I wish you could tell uh, which ones are dead and which ones aren't. Okay, that one is clearly not dead yet, but now it is. Okay, that one was dead already. How about that one? I thought I clicked that on this guy already once, too. Okay. white crane. Don't her last name is Lingji. <laughs> or I guess that would be her first name then? Her first name is Lingji. Dang. Your mom named you after a mushroom? That's terrible. <laughs> what? Ishi died? Wait. Is someone is the the dismal white crane is running around killing people? <laughs> oh my gosh! You know what? Um, we can't even resurrect you either. Oh no! We could resurrect you, but oh man, Nai Dai is gonna be upset. And Tiu Wan's up here too. She doesn't have someone that she's with. Nai Dai is going to be really heated. So who is... is it? It's this guy. Did all of my cultivators just abandon the fight again? 
Oh man, what an episode. <laughs> what an episode. They just stop fighting. The dismal white crane was able to uh, strike back. <sighs> Guess that'll teach us for laughing at people's names while they're still alive. Uh, so the thing is, I don't think I can feed them uh, anything, right? So do we have a rebirth pill? We actually need more rebirth pills if we don't have any. Okay, we do have some. So if can I feed you two? So you're not even in the list. So the only way we could bring you back to life is... Their obsession gems. Do I want to do that? Night die would be pretty pretty peeved. Seems like an awful waste to use uh resurrection on a peasant. I don't think there's any other way to bring him back. I mean I can't feed him any uh any of our uh, elixirs or anything. It's just move or bury. He's not in the dying state at all, he just fell over. Why does he not have a coat on? I guess that's just how he rolls. Um, sure, you know what? Why not? Hopefully, um... No one comes and stops Sutra Dude, because that would be really tragic. Mm -hmm. Yeah, he's really shredded, but hey, he'll live. He'll live. Alright. Ah, we did not get furious. Drat. Yeah, just kind of a unfortunate episode for us. Unfortunate. <laughs> yeah. Made quite a few mistakes in this one, but oh well. It is what it is. If we could make a robot play the game, then we wouldn't be playing the game, would be. Trucci recovery is decent, I guess. Plus, you get the mood multiplier. Hmm. Whatever. Yeah, we'll put it in. Maybe we'll get it. I don't know. I suppose I wouldn't be uh, opposed to that. But literally, none of this is useful at all. So, I guess we're just going to lose. We definitely don't want regretful either. So, it's going to have to be furious or. Whatever the uh, 1.0 for int is, I'd be fine with that as well. A bit ticked off as the 0.5, so that's not going to be good enough. Uh, I don't... Um, or maybe, uh, maybe the tier 2 for luck, but... Maybe we were too... Um, if we're being too picky, because I kind of do want to get sculptures. I feel like that is a pretty good green stat for him. <laughs> Defecating? I mean, that's like sightseeing, but worse. Is there another sightseeing? Oh, there is. Okay. Well, I suppose I'd be fine with that, I guess. I mean, that's not a bad one. That's a, that's a decent one. I'd rather have those two. Remold speed sounds a lot better. But I guess I'd be okay with uh, sightseeing. Yeah, none of these other ones uh, look interesting to us at all. 
And honestly, I would really like to, if it's not going to be furious, we really need to get something locked in here. I'd be okay with yearning, maybe. A bit happy, perhaps. I suppose we don't really need the fire damage reduction because a physical cultivator would never fight the phoenix. Because remember, if we break off one of its parts as a physical cultivator, it just focuses its laser of death on that person. And a physical cultivator is just going to keel over. And we can't resurrect them. Uh, that's the Luan Ho story. <laughs> so I guess... Oh, man. Maybe if we can get that, maybe we'll take it. I guess. And that, too. Might as well. Because uh, I really would like to keep sculptures, and I have this sneaking suspicion it's going to be hard to find that one again. Like, really hard. Uh, I suppose Lake is decent, too. But I just don't know how good Secret Body Suppression is. Maybe that's a good thing. I don't know. They're, they're like level one. That's why I'm like, it's probably not very good. Then what's Secret Body Penetration Needles? Let's think on this, and then let's look at your stats here. Chi recovery, additional breathing, battle stats, body power. Five point oh one percent. So did he get? Did he get sculptures and gems as well, then? I don't remember doing that on BE. Accuracy, defense. OK, here's so the bonus value applied to the Chi Bear penetration. <laughs> OK. So I suppose there is some. Um, Ability to punch through their chi bearer and hit their body with that. What's suppression? Yeah, so this is the so this is what I thought it was the artifact suppression chance. So periodically, while we're attacking a, a Xiandao cultivator or, or a Shendao, but I don't think there are any Shendao in the game, um, we can lock down their artifact using suppression. It uses up true chi though, so you can't hold on to it for very long. Max Painful Memories is only six. Hmm. Did not realize that. Did not realize that at all. Okay. Frog is thinking, I think I've done enough damage in this game for one episode. What do you guys think? <laughs> That's like... Anything that could go wrong will go wrong. Is uh, It's a Murphy's episode, unfortunately for us this time. She fell to the ground. Yeah, he's he's okay, though. He's getting healed as we speak. We'll give him uh, this room again. And I'm assuming uh, their uh, relationship is still good, right? Yeah. Yes. They're still, uh, they're still a happy couple. We're just out seven uh, obsession gems, sadly. So we'll smelt these away. Uh, ooh, spell cooldown. I think we will take that. I'm I'm starting to I'm starting to soften up to uh, to spell stuff, like even more. Especially, I mean, just just for the the fact that you can restore your chi and and that all gets modified, it's kind of nice. At least for like the tribulations and whatnot. Okay. 
So uh, we'll do one more uh, breakthrough for this episode, and then maybe finally, next episode, Woodshang can finally leave us, right? Um, let's actually have him eat this stuff first. I don't think he needs anything else, but... Oh, and also... Uh, what? Make sure, yeah, it's still the right stuff. Those, uh, <laughs> those, uh, <laughs> they, like, fused there for a second. Okay. Eat that, and then... I think, yeah, you'll have no problems with this one. So this tribulation is metal, and metal gets scorched by fire. So there we go. I think, uh, I think we'll wrap the episode up there. Like I said, I think I've done enough damage now. Man. Yeah, note to self, 1%. Just send it over. Honestly, maybe even earlier than that, honestly. I don't see any reason why we shouldn't. Apparently we uh, don't have one of our work. Oh, we don't have a miner. Uh, that was probably Ishii who died recently. That was our miner? Huh. I would think it should be Yang Shea instead. He doesn't even have a pickaxe. It was really Ishii? Oh, you know what? His stats are low right now. So, yeah, he is going to be our miner, right? He was at least okay at it. Gotcha. Uh, yeah. So, it says 7 right now, but it'll be a lot better than 7 when he's, uh... Yeah, 7 of, seven of 21, 32%, I think, is the health factor. So, it'll probably be close to 21 or something like that when he's, uh, alive again. So, I don't think we need to worry about this exclamation point. It says miner is lacking manpower, but that's just temporary. Not like we need a miner anyway right now. So, I hope you enjoyed uh, anyway, even despite all our tragic failures. Um, next episode, we'll continue to work on, of course, Jing is going to continue to cultivate, um, get her inner cauldron going. Uh, she might not go this year, I think, because it's actually it's her time right now to to break through. So she's definitely not going to make it this year, uh, but perhaps next year. Um, and yeah, we'll uh, get Wood Shang uh, finished here. He's uh, breaking through another round right now. We'll continue it then. If there's something that you'd like to see in the sect, feel free to drop a comment and I will consider it. And up until the next time though, peace. Gosh, look at all that chi restoration. <laughs>